Hello there, everyone. Welcome back to Tuff. Diddy Kong Racing Extreme Edition. In the last episode, what we did was we uh, finished the fourth world silver coins, and this time we're going to do all the bonus levels from every world. So this episode might be a bit short, but the next one will be really long because the next episode is all the trophy races. We'll see how that goes. The first person to hatch three eggs will win. Okay then. I missed. How did I miss? How did I miss? Okay, whatever. It's fine. The idea is just to steal them from other people. If you miss, just steal them. Oh wait, Pips is getting two. <gasps> that can't be. Ah! Oh. Don't worry, I've got this in the bag. I know the technique. It's just to be an asshole. I missed! <laughs> that's unfortunate, I missed. Oh well, that's fine. Like I said, this won't be a very long video because it won't take that long to win all the four. The worlds one and four bonus stages are really quite interesting, but the um, world two and three bonus stages are t basically copies of one another, which is a bit of a shame. But there is only limited space on an N64 cartridge, so I understand. Be an asshole. Steal everyone else's eggs. Did he try to steal mine? Don't worry, I'm just going to go back and forth. They won't keep trying to steal mine. Eventually they'll give up. Wah! I've got to stop missing. Like, really. Okay. Fibsy, you're next on my list. Sorry, i got to be a jerk face. Okay. You bastard. I might just camp, did he? Wait, mine was put back? <laughs> Who put mine back? Okay, that's fine. Well, I'm just gonna camp, did he come? The minute he puts one down, I'm going to be ready. Okay, here we go. Joey's big plate. And the minute he comes puts one down, I'm going to steal it. There we go. I'm ready. I'm going for the four. No, you don't. There you go. Excellent. We are the winner. Hey, Taj. Hello there. You won first prize. Yay. Which is a piece of the t, -t amulet. You have three more to collect. Good luck. Okay, let's do it. So the best strategy I can find for the egg challenge is just to be an asshole. So when any of the comms put an egg down, you steal it. And if you, you pick a rival and just steal their eggs constantly. Sometimes you can't keep on top of all three, which is what happened with Pipsy. I was too far away because we were on polar, op polar opposites of the map. It's much easier when it's Tip Top or Diddy Kong in that situation because they're closer to me. Whee! I thought I was in a hovercraft. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Hello, I'd like to be in a plane, please. Thank you. Goodbye.
Okay, we're gonna go to Iceland now. You can do a downwards flip, uh, loop to loop, and I've never actually done one in this game because there's no point in doing it at all. Let's go. It's time to go to Icicle Pyramid. The last player remaining will win. Well, I have a strategy for this too. It doesn't always work, but it works sometimes. The strategy is this. It's to be a little shit. My strategy is always just to be a little shit. The note is a theme. <laughs> so I'm not going to talk very much because, again, my strategy is just to be an asshole. Sometimes you get hit like that, but that's okay. It happens. We I got spun around. Now hopefully they'll kill each other. If not, then I can do it. If not, then I'll happily kill them all. It's not it might not be very interesting, but this is it certainly works. Okay, we're all down to two. This is going to be closer than I thought. I just got to be first on the trigger. Ooh. There's a solid attempt at a hit. Wait, Pipsy's dead. Now they're going to hunt me down like a pig. I'd leave. Goodbye! Oh yeah, I'm getting cornered. Whoa. Let them fight each other. Just stop chasing me? Jesus! Well, that's it. There's only one thing for it. Diddy Kong's dead. Tip Top the Menace is gonna come and find me. But I'm going to be ready for him. Unless I miss. There we go. <laughs> I was hoping to use a homing missile and shoot him from afar, but it didn't quite happen that way. Anyway, I'm really boring, so that's what I like to do. I like to, I like to just cheap them out. Sit in the middle. They'll have to come to me eventually and then just shoot them in the face. Sometimes it works better than other times. Let's leave. Oh, it, make, it makes me go into a car, but I was supposed to be in a car here. As long as I'm still in a plane when I leave, that's all right. I am. Whack! Oh, it's time to go to the third wall. Let's do it. The third wall is basically a copy of the second world, except you're in an ocean instead of in an icicle pyramid. But the idea is still the same, that you kill each other. Which is why I say it's a copy. Not that it looks the same, just that the gameplay is the same. But the fourth one is a lot more interesting, in my opinion. Okay. Sherwood Island. I did get this key, didn't I? I did. Excellent. Dark Water Beach. Dark Water Beach. There's another technique for cheating this one. Turn around here. You can notice a theme pretty soon. The theme is just shoot things until people die. Camp the the relevant balloons and then shoot them in the face. Oh, 
like so. Bye. Right, so. <laughs> what was that one going, Bibsy? Shot it into the fucking stratosphere. Here we go. That was not supposed to be a rocket. It was supposed to be a missile. Right. Ow. Sometimes you get hit like that. You can't help it. If they have a homing missile, there's not a lot you can do. Right. Um, uh, Pipsy killed herself. That's unfortunate. Bye. There we go. See? No problem at all. I know that's not how you're supposed to play the game, but if that's not how you're supposed to play the game, why did they let me do it? Just one more piece of the amulet to go. Yay! Now it's time for the fourth one. There's no cheating in the fourth one. You have to do it legit. But it shouldn't be that hard. I don't think. Here we go. Let's go. <laughs> Everyone's going to call me a scumlord in the comments like, how could you? This game was built by love and you've destroyed it with your bullshit. I'm sorry, okay? I didn't mean it. Whee! Quack. Okay. Let me in. There we go, thank you. Let's go down here and then let's go down the tree. Because this one's inside a tree. There we go. Right, this one, you have to get 10 bananas into their treasure chest. And this is kind of cool, actually. It's a cool little minigame. Right, so what's the fastest way out of here? This way. You have to get 10 bananas. Getting hit will make you lose a banana. Okay. Okay. So, you have to get 10 bananas, you can only carry two at a time. At least that's what I remember. Let's see if I am correct. I think so. I think that's true. The best way to do this is just to go in tight circles around yourself. So, you go down here, you do the same thing every time. So you go down this way, then you get this one. Yeah, so you can only carry two. They respawn fairly frequently. And then you go around here. Son of a bitch. Right, if you get hit, you lose your bananas, but that's not important. They, just, they stick around for a while. Okay. Let's get this one, and then repeat. This should work every time. Because the bananas will always be around somewhere. There's usually at least two on this little circuit that I make for myself. So... Always, yes, you have to do the wiggle. I'm sorry, you just have to. Especially with country slow. You have to do the wiggle. Oh no, there wasn't one there, but there's like two here, so it shouldn't be an issue. Ah, they took them. See, that's when the comms get a little bit clever. They actually take my bananas, but that means I just go around again. Then double back on myself because it's quicker. Okay, let's go. Final victory, Oogle. There we go. Easy peasy. Just a solid 80% of the time you can just go get those two bananas by going around in circles. But I got the Tutut amulet now. The amulet is complete, uses to enter the TT door. Well done! So, when I was a kid, I looked all the way around this fucking world for a TT door. I was like, I have no idea where this door is. Absolutely none. But it isn't here. You're not supposed to get it here. Much to my surprise. Let's go do the trophy races. So next time, I'll see you in a bit when we do all the trophy races of the game. That episode might be a little bit longer, but we'll find out. See you guys then!